Hey, how's it going guys? JC here. So the 1st of December 2018 was the day that I hit 100k subscribers. On the 12th of March 2019 was the day I finally received my silver play button. It actually comes in a black pizza box, which is pretty hilarious. And yeah, this is the back, the front. We're going to be unboxing this and I'll be talking through a few things while we're doing this. The point of this video is not only to share a very important milestone in my YouTube career, but also to document it so in the future I get to look back and see what I've achieved. So I sort of want to create this little memory that I can look back in the future to this video just to see a very important time in my YouTube career. With 23k views, by the way, these videos get very little views compared to my other videos that get at least double or triple the amount. For the few that are actually watching this video, especially you watching the video right now, are the ones that actually help me get to where I am. Not the mass viewers that just watch what's clickbaity, but the ones that stick with me through even the simple titles and videos and little milestones and achievements. To show my appreciation, here are the rest of the Nivea codes that I have left. So be sure to take it and use it as quickly as you can because they're gonna go pretty much instantly. I actually cannot thank you guys enough, the ones that are watching this particular video, for getting me to where I am right now because you guys are the very loyal ones and I just want to share with you guys my analytics as well you know as if you're sitting next to me about two or three weeks ago just before I started my Iron 4 series I had about 40k views per 48 hours and now it's at 130k which is really amazing but it also takes a crap ton of work I literally have to stay up all the way to like 6 or 8 a.m editing I have to sit through queue times of 30 minutes and then sometimes dodge and then you know another 30 minute wait time and then there's the rental guy that stays up all the way to like 3 or even 5 a.m. sometimes. So I have to wait for him. But sometimes I get impatient, I just play. This is the result is I have a lot of pimples on my face, but also the fact that I was able to upload every single day. Some of you might be asking, why don't you just play in the daytime? And to that, I say that the reflection is really, really bad. Like when you play in the daytime, the webcam's completely ruined for some reason. Like the lighting is just absolutely terrible during the daytime. There's two roommates. The other roommate is awake during the daytime, so it doesn't really help. But I can see that daytime could be a possibility. I just really need to fix my sleep as well. And for those that are wondering, my webcam is a C920 Logitech. So apparently that's like a really, really good webcam. But whenever I make a video where I just full screen my face, you guys say that, oh, you can't afford a good webcam. But I'm just thinking, that is a pretty decent webcam. And as for the analytics you guys see on screen, it's just a way of documenting or freeze framing a time in my life that I will be able to look back at the future and also share with you guys some behind the scenes. So how YouTube works is last 48 hours, this is the amount of views you get per video and um, estimated views, you get this per hour. So it's like really nice to know. And I, I just obsessively stare at this just to see which videos do well. And I have to say the Kale one, on the very first hour, it had 3,000 views. Videos like this one, where it's not part of the Iron 4 to Diamond series, it gets about 2K views to 1,800 on the very first hour. So the first hour is always like, you know, a massive spike. And then after that, it just dies down from there. You guys can see the graph, it just dies down. This Kale one is doing amazing because it still has 400 views after being uploaded like six days ago. So this is top of the range. These are my most viewed videos as of late in the past, you know, 48 hours. So yeah, having a series on your YouTube channel really helps. You get people to watch each episode, so that's really nice. And then you have a video like this one that ties everything together, which is how to consistently carry low elo, seeing I'm playing low elo all the time. Anyways, without further ado, I'm gonna start unboxing so that you guys can see just exactly what's inside that pizza box, and let's get to it. <laughs> Okay, so moment of truth. Whoa. Let's have a read of the certificate. So this is the certificate that I got. Let's have a look at the plaque itself. So behind it is a silver. Oh my God, it's fully metal. Like it's actually complete metal. Wait, what's the back? Wait, no, it's plastic. This thing's metal. This part is plastic, by the way, guys. It looks metal, right? Wait, no, actually, it is metal. So, as you guys can see, it says, Presented to JC for passing 100,000 subscribers. Also, the back is this really soft black material. And I guess we have two little hinges to hang it up somewhere. 
Thank you guys so much for watching to the end of this video. I really hope that this video has added some value to you guys, maybe some insight, some background knowledge uh, behind the scenes that you guys might appreciate. Thank you guys once again, and I'll see you all in the next video. Cheers.